Now moving on to the equation 6. They have given us an equation for theta. And theta is basically the temperature of a computer processor t minutes after the computer is switched off is modeled by this equation where a and k are positive constants. Given that the temperature of the processor was 75 degrees Celsius when the computer was switched off. So switched off basically means that, I mean by this line, they have given us an information that's that when t equals zero, the value of theta is 75. Now we just need to find out the value of a. So if we substitute this, these two values into the equation, I think we can find out the value of a. So theta is 75 when the value of t is 0. So that's 21 plus a e to the power negative k times 0. And e to the power 0 is basically 1. So from this we can find out the value of a. So the value of a is 54. So that is it for the first part of the question. Now let's move on to the next part. Given also that it takes 5 minutes for the temperature of the processor to, to decrease from 75 to 25 degrees Celsius. So they have said that when t is equals to 5, the value of theta is 25. So let's substitute this into the equation and we can find out the value of k. So when the value of theta is 25, the value of k, uh, the value of t is 5. So that's e to the power negative 5k. Now we just need to make k the subject. So this will be e to the power negative 5k is equals to 4. So k would be equals to negative 1 over 5 ln 4. So let's calculate the value of k. Negative 1 over 5 ln 4. So this will give us a value of... Uh, okay. Okay, so there was a problem with the question. Uh, I mean, a problem in this step. This will be 4 over 54. So 4 over 54, if we simplify this, this will give us 2 over 27. Sorry for that. So this will be 2 divided by 27. So this will be equals to around 0 0.521. So that is the answer to the second part of the question. Now moving on to the third part. At time t minutes, the temperature of the processor is decreasing at a rate of 9 degrees Celsius per minute. Okay, so for this question, we need to find out the value of d theta over dt because they have given us the rate, the decreasing rate. So they're talking about d theta over dt. dt. So if we differentiate this equation, uh, this will give us minus a times k e to the power minus kt. And we know that the value of a is 54 and the value of k is 0 0.521. So 54 times 0 0.521 will give us 28.134 so this will be 28.134 and the negative sign will be there okay so when the value of t is unknown which is t the value of d theta over dt is equals to 9 but there is a catch it is decreasing which means that the gradient will be negative. So it will be negative 9. So now let's solve this equation. So that d theta over dt is equals to negative 9. And 
this equation can be written as negative 28.134 e to the power negative 0 0.521 t is equals to negative 9. Now these two negative signs cancels each other out. So if we make t the subject, this will give us negative 1 divided by 0 0.521 ln 9 divided by 28.134. So let's calculate the value of this. So this is equals to around 2.19 minutes. So that is the answer to question 6 and I will see you guys in the next video and if you have any confusion regarding the answers please let us know in the comment section and we will try to answer each and every single comments as soon as possible.